Okay, we're all packed up, ready to go. We're about to head out, head up on another trip. And this is going to be the first time we've used our new, or well, new second hand wild boar camper trailer. And just going to give it a, see how she pulls with this. We've got this protector hitch on here. And this thing here, I've used them before and other trailers and they are really, really good. They just take all the bumps out of the out of the ride. Got an airbag and shockies in there. It just makes it really, really nice to to pull. Okay, so we're going out to going up to a different property and hopefully we'll be able to get some pigs and dogs. I am taking a few traps with just in case I get time, but just mostly like a, a weekend um, trip up to some friend's place and he said bring your guns because there's plenty of pigs and dogs, so <laughs> we'll see what happens. I'll keep you posted. start already just got down the road and there's a dog on there just on the edge of the road so I gunned it and he come out and he didn't want to run into the long grass he took off down the middle of the bitch and I lined him up went straight over the top of him and he got caught in the oh, yeah, electric cables that where the trailer camper hub plugs into the car and he must have been dragging for a bit by the time I stopped and got out he'd unplugged the cables and he was gone and he ran off <laughs> Well, I was expecting to find a dead dog in the bitch of it, but anyway, hopefully we can get some more this weekend. Anyway, we're out here at this new property. A friend of, a friend of ours a work here and they said I can come out here and do some trapping and shoot dogs and pigs and whatever. We're just looking here to go and set a few traps in here. Bit of a lagoon down here. So, we might stick one in here. See how we go. We've been out shooting tonight while well, we're out looking. We had a few and you know, trying to howl up some dogs. I saw four this afternoon and one dog they're off. So just stop drop me off here if you keep going. Yeah. Come out over here. yeah. If you keep going down the track there. Did you see him again? Yeah, oh, just here, yeah. 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 But didn't get it, managed to get a shot at them. They're all a bit too far away and I wasn't gonna mess up the shots. We went out and tried it, doing a bit of howling with the thermoscope and but didn't manage to find any any dogs on our way home and I shot this shot at this huge pig who come out across the road in front of us and I, I hit him with the 308 but I, he lost him in the cloud of smoke and I know I hit him because I heard the thud but we, he disappeared off into the scrub in the thick scrub but he was a huge pig would have been probably at least 120 kilos, I'd say, at a guess. So anyway, it was a shame I couldn't find him. But anyway, come back, I was talking to my mate here and I was just heading out to the camper trailer to go to bed and I hear a pig squeal out in the, behind the cattle yards. <laughs> so I grabbed the thermal and well, this is what happened.
But anyway, a bit of, bit of excitement for one night. I didn't take the camera with me. And I was just in my pyjamas out of the shower. I was about to get in bed, so anyway, I'll go and I'll have a look at them tomorrow in the daylight and see what they look like. I'll see you in the morning. Right, it's starting to get light. And I've got up, I'm going to go out with the, my mate, he's going to go and do a ball run. So we might get out and go early and we might get a chance of spotting a dog and maybe sit down and try and howl one up early in the morning. So, yeah, I'll we'll see how we go. I heard one about uh, three o'clock this morning, not far from the camper. I went in the paddock a bit, but I thought, oh, I didn't really want to get up and shoot and disturb everyone sleeping. <laughs> They're close to the house, so... <laughs> I didn't feel like getting them back, getting up either. The back's been pretty cooked the last couple of days, so don't feel like doing too much walking. <laughs> anyway, we'll get going and see what we can find. Just see his head and ears sticking up in the sunlight. The wash out there. The sun's right above him. Alright, it's up here. Switch the engine off. Got him, I see him thrashing around a bit there. As long as he doesn't get up in again. I'll go for a walk down there and go and find him. Just coming along here and just see the dog ears sticking up over that, that red feet, that blue feeder over there. And he's out in this long grass. Waist high on me, he's jumping up in the air a bit to try and see where he's going. Have a look, good look at this. I could just see his head and top of his back over the grass. So, I dropped him down over here somewhere. We'll go and have a look, see what we've got. Good. He took his spine out, eh? In the first shot. Yeah. What is it? A bitch. It's good. Let's see. Oh, old enough one. Has never had pups, though. So. Got it through the neck the first shot. That explains why the head went back. Yeah. But running around with the got this hyperpod with me from Eagle Eye hunting gear. 
um, which is ideal for when you got to run around out in the heat and have a shot off the instead of having it off the shoulder but then just had air from the heat what's that about 150 meters um, it's one dog down for the trip hopefully we can get a few more He's still there, can get on a bit. Yeah, it's still moving. He's big. <laughs> you hit him. <laughs> he just went down, I think. You want to go for a walk over there? Yeah. Is he the one you shot first? No. The one I shot first is the black one that went up higher. Yeah. <laughs> oh, that's good. I want to go and have a look at him. He's big. <laughs> well, just coming along here on the track and see how a big mob of pigs take off in the grass. Up here there's been a must be a dead beast or something up here. And we're shooting at the shooting at a few with a lead. The next thing you see this huge one, he had stayed back behind him, big black and white fella. He took a fair bit of a fair few shots to stop him, so he's gonna walk up and see what see how big he really is. Get some photos of him. <laughs> this is a beast I've been after. Been in the back end to and around a bit. The big one's just up in here, I think. The rest of the mob went that way. Oh, can't find him walking to the grass, so we put up the drone and see if we can get him, find him with that. Mate's just over there looking around if I can direct him. Okay, so there's a dead beast. This pig should have been. There he is. Oh, my mate found him first. Yeah, he's a decent size. He would have been a good one for a page of dogs. He took some stopping, though. Yeah. No wonder that one I shot last night. Oh, he's hard in there. Yeah. So Good lump of a pig. Got blood there, so you Might have been a two D three just bouncing off him. <laughs> <laughs> I'll roll him over and Oh he's a sickness to him. Mm. We had a couple up yeah. here. They're just going up ahead. <laughs> Good shooting. <laughs> Where do they come from? Fucking come back down these pads in the trough. I was worried as to how far around the horse beauty is getting. I'll find it with this, maybe. Oh yeah. Here's this other one mate just shot he just they just come up through the through the grass here behind us when we're just standing near that other one he shot. The sour, a heap of little piglets ran down here somewhere. Not sure where they went. I can't even see him in the drone. But it's 
sun's still shining across, can't see a lot of shadows in the grass there. Makes it a bit hard to see. Here you can see even the, that, this pig just here, she's even a bit hard to see. Some old, old wellers there. Dog tracks here. No fresh tracks, you can see. Okay, we're just coming out here to have a look at these ones I got last night. Here's this one boar. He got, looks a bit bigger than he did last night. <laughs> he looks a lot fatter than he did last night. He's a bit bloated. Yeah. Another one over here somewhere. Another little, another little ball. There's another one, little one. And then there's another one up here. There's three pigs. 